We then looked at overall survival for the combination of pembrolizumab with chemotherapy with the extreme regimen in the total population without biomarker selection. And there, there was also a benefit for the early use of pembrolizumab. So pembrolizumab plus chemotherapy improved overall survival from 10.7 to 13 months with a hazard ratio of 0.77. Here, the response rates were comparable. The progression-free survivals were, were not significantly different. The um, amount of grade three to five toxicity, the amount of overall Overall toxicity quite similar and again patients who had a response saw a more durable response and again the survival benefit was still visible at, at two years. So this demonstrates that early use of pembrolizumab in patients with recurrent metastatic cancer leads to an improvement in overall survival in head and neck cancer and so for patients who have the biomarker enrichment who are PDL1 expressing it appears as if pembrolizumab alone as first-line therapy is superior to anything that we've been doing before. And for patients who are not biomarker enriched, the combination of chemotherapy plus pembrolizumab is also superior to what we've been doing before.